I know what you're thinking. Why would I want you to take my photos on a cloudy, cold winter day? Well, I'm about to tell you. What up guys, this is Jason from Jason Dash Photography out of Denver, Colorado, and here's a few reasons why I just love taking photos on a winter cloudy day. Now everybody knows that golden hour is the king of natural light, but on a cloudy day, I believe it's the total opposite because the cloud cover diminishes the power of the sun. So in this case, you may have less hours of light in a winter day, but 80% of that light will be your best light instead of your worst light. So how can a cloud covered winter day be a good option for lighting? I'll put it this way, why do you need to lug around large studio lights, huge modifiers when you got the biggest natural softbox available? When using bare studio lights and speed lights, it puts off a harsh light just like the midday sun. That means the highlight to shadow transition is instant. Now if you put a softbox in front of that light, or in our case a giant fluffy cloud, That'll create nice, soft, flattering light. That means the highlight to shadow fall off is hardly noticeable to where the highlights end and the shadows begin. And being winter and all, don't forget about all the winter snow that can be under and around you. That snow is just another tool for soft light. And even if it is a sunny day, you can find a shaded spot and utilize that snow to reflect the sunlight coming in. Last plus I'll mention is wardrobe. Maybe a nice sundress or your favorite tea is what you had in mind. But don't forget about the setting that winter brings. You have so many different styles and layers to choose from, from coats to gloves to hats to boots. There's so many different designs out there to help with your look. And if you insist on that dress or that shirt, all it takes is a couple of minutes to take your coat off so you can get the multiple looks that you're looking for for your shoes. Thanks for watching guys and remember to click that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next time.